Race number 11 here at Armory Digital Super Speedway. David Davison and Keith Stevens on the front row. Here is the full qualifying results. And whoa, Derek Edison, 2 minutes 16 seconds. Wow. So there's something definitely wrong with that truck. It takes uh, everyone else about 51 seconds, but we'll see what he does in the race. About 10 seconds away from the race command, let's uh, discuss points. As we have three races left. Here is the race command. Drivers, fire up your engines! Engines fired up, here we go. So the 71 who starts second last, 37th, has a 37 point lead. Oh, that damn thing, that text box keeps getting in the way. Yes, yeah, a 37 point lead over the 62 truck, who starts right behind the three. Two teammates, see how they work with each other. But of course, everyone's trying to get a win. David Davidson is actually one of the championship contenders actually. So, teammates out the window. He's fourth in points. He's only 69 points behind the uh, points leader. And whoa, the truck sparks coming out. That was a sharp, really sharp left turn. Yeah, 69 points. Eli Bright is 46 points behind the race points leader and 9 points from second. Eli Bright, the only one with two wins this season as we're getting ready for the green. Yeah, Bright starts right behind te the Texas World winner. Green flag is out. We're underway here at Armory Digital. Great start for the three. Trucks like Talladega where the start finish line is. They got lights on the um, on the track too. There they are. I think we only race this track once. Besides an exhibition race. So two ice in total. And here he comes. To the race lead. Got taken out at Texas World. Cost him a lot of points. But here goes Alexander Rowe making a four wide. Well, oh, random freezing. Oh, we got a crash. Got a crash right on the first lap. And the caution flag is definitely out. And here comes the 82, or no, the 56. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, there we go. Right, so I feel like it's very, it's a lot closer than you think. But caution out on the first lap. We'll take a look at the replay. Pushing on that left side. That's what caused it. Keith Stevens, who started second in this race, already getting taken out. Multiple trucks going around. You can see the one going down, clip the five. Pretty much anyone on the outside, and well, some, well, actually everyone, pretty much got swept up. 24 made it through. 53 goes right through the grass. 99 with a lot of damage. Any trucks smoking? Oh, big hit right there. But a 94 and a 8. Well, that's definitely gonna slow both of them down. Well, they piled up, but it wasn't that big of a wreck. Well, yeah, well, it was the big one. It was a big pile up. But most of them just got out with uh, just a couple of scratches, pretty much. But most of the damage at the front end, the back, no one flipped, no one hit real hard. No one slapped the wall, no one went over, no one got rammed. So definitely a big pile up, and well, I guess that's the only big hit right there, the 8 and the 94. But there's your first caution of the night. We'll take you back to the restart. So the lights are out, it's getting ready for the green, the 8, the 57, the 94, and the 99 out of the race. So you get set for the restart. Okay, struck is in, here we go. The other bright third in points, currently fifth. 62, currently in second. And six 
I, I mean fourth. I say fifth. Fourth, Free Light Bright, fifth with the 62. Truck, David Davison. Right there in seventh. Green flag is out. Here we go. We're back underway. Alec is on a roll. Here he goes inside. Currently 16th in point with the victory. Up below us, the 81 is 24th, lost 7 spots. He is the lowest with the win. So let's see if they get a cleaner lap this time with them all spread out. So it'll take some time for these guys to punch back up. There they go. And there goes the 3. Who's going to lead the lap? Davidson has the advantage. Got a big shot from the 85, but there he goes to the inside. But well, looks like the three will, yes, lead him. So that'll definitely help. A 71, nowhere to be seen so far. Alexander will push that 62 real hard and he finally gets off. Here goes the 24 who avoided that big wreck. Now in the race lead. Take a look where the 71 is. Right there in 24th that last time around. The other three are, are up there in the top 10, top 15. You can see some damage on the right side. I don't think that's affecting him. Gets with all the slower restarts. Separates the field and look at the 66 has more damage. And she's uh, a lot closer. Hillary Sanchez, 7th in points. And got a car, truck in the wall. That's the 81. Able to get off it. Dexter Black in the 2. Was leading in overtime. End up getting taken out. Once they were coming to the white flag. Hoping to get one back tonight. Jerry Gettison is making moves. The two minute qualifying speed. He was able to avoid the wreck. But all the way down to the grass. The only one to do it. And right now he's up there in the top ten. About to crack the top five. Trey Wright in the six. Has yet to win a race in this series. Got one at the line. Who's it going to be? Eli... No. Why, why, I say, I mean, Jeff Bright. Yes, Jeff Bright let that lap. Yeah. 41 got down to the apron, held them up, held up the 91. They lose several spots. So 53 moves up. Trying to get second here. Big shove. And a 53 from last to first with under 10 laps. But here goes Alex in a row. Can he lead him? Coming to the line. No. Wait, wait, wait. Right. No. Contact, contact. Five wide. Another truck in the wall. The wall is six. Still in the wall. Gets off it. Is there a track man we could take a look at? Yes, yes there is. Bit of a unique shape. 2.6 uh, mile oval. It's round 1 and 2 they really get in there. It's weird about this racetrack. Here goes Jeff Bright. Oh, he only gets turned by Dexter Black. Got down to the apron just a bit. Side by side, Jeff Bright leads the lap. Trey Wright just kept the wall again, but he's alright. He keeps on going. So far only one wreck, one caution. And four cars out of the race. Trucks. 38, very slow. 37 seconds back. And you can see him. Leaders are coming.
far wide, two rows deep. Maybe even five wide. Yeah, there they go. Trying to make it five wide. Now there's some room. It's a pretty wide racetrack. They could definitely go five wide and make it stick. Go back to four wide to clear to six. And there they come. Yeah, I don't think they should go five wide. Closing in on a slow truck. And the three gets them on the back straight away before they enter the corner. And at 56, the first one to get caught up. We'll get to see. They got another wreck. What's the 38 truck doing? Oh, contact. There goes a the nine. Back in front of traffic. Right back. Yeah, back in traffic. So it separates the field. Now the pack split into two. 92 now being held up by the 38. And there he goes to the inside. Close call right there. David Davis in the three. Has yet to win a race. Be a big win for the three team. Help him a lot in the championship hunt. Eli Brighton in the 30 trying to stop that. Trying to go for his third one of the season. Could he do it? Only one driver was able to do it before and he won the championship. Eli Bright trying to do the same as he goes to third looking for second. All the Chevrolet is in the picture. 83, the only Toyota right now in the top five. No Fords in sight. Highest running Ford is... The... The 71. It was on 20th. We do have a Dodge up here. So yeah, that's the highest running Ford. Didn't realize how many Chevrolets there are. See, everywhere you go, there's a Chevrolet. There's like two Dodges, I think. I'm not sure. Or is it just the one Dodge? 38's another Ford. Yeah, I can remember all of them. Three over is still leading. Also leading the most laps. Get maximum points. 185 points. That's the maximum you can get. That's what the three trucks doing. He used be able to use that lap truck as a pick. Separate the pack. He knew. That means there'll be less trucks to gang up on him so he can stay out front longer and lead those laps. Top four, single file. There goes Anderson. He moves to the inside. Gotta be five laps to go. Want to hit the line this time. It's ED3 on the bottom without any help. He has a run. Here goes the 24 trying to shoot the middle, but he goes back to the outside. That allows the three to pull away just a bit. Let him maintain the lead a lot longer. Five to go. Five laps remaining. Driver's trying to get back in. Eli Pride is dropping back a few. Kyle trying to make it two in a row as he looks to the inside for second place. Will I catch that 38 truck again? Uh, maybe. Here's the third pack, I think. This is the third pack. 66 running all alone. Was up there at one point, but can't. Uh, looks like he fell back. Orius falling back. Yeah, this is the second pack. Yeah, they lost touch with the lead pack. Probably because it's the 38. Maybe. Four laps remaining. The three still leading. Started on pole. Looking to lead all the laps and win the race. I think he'll take the points lead away if he wins tonight's race. 91 giving him a push. That's what's keeping him away from the pack. 24 and 2. They're trying to team up. Trying to catch those two. Now look at that too. He's just pushing at 24 and he goes to the inside. Looked like he gave up on that quickly.
But there he is. He's on the back bumper. He gave a good enough push. But now he's on the outside. He might lose a few. 62 coming back up. Got three championship contenders right in the mix of things. And the 41 almost wrecked. That was a close call. Three still leading. 91 staying in second, but there he goes. He makes a move. I think he's got, and he has help. Coming to two laps to go. Right time to make a move or no? We'll see if the 91 can hang on. Dexter Black giving the 91 a push. He goes to the outside, trying to cover the top, but here goes the two. Looking for some redemption after Texas World Speedway. Two laps to go. Left at Armory Digital. Four wide here. Four wide. And yep, there they go. Coming up on the 38 and once again. With two laps to go. Will they make it this time? Will they make it again or will they wreck? The three will get held up. He goes to the outside. Oh, the 42. Oh, man. Will they get the white or will they wreck? Dexter Black in the two, he's got three teammates pretty much you could say. Right behind him. 62 up in the second. Could he get a win finally? White flag is out. One more time around. There's a three, there's a 30. Here comes the 62 but here goes the 82. Dexter Black trying to block his teammate there. But Kyle takes, the, takes advantage. He takes the race lead. Can he clear? No, not quite. Two's got a lot of help. Back straight away on the outside. Here comes the rest. Extra black right in front and he got him. Big help. Here comes the three. Here comes the 30. 82. 42. Here they come. Off of four. Coming to the checkered flag. Dexter Black, David Davison, and a three on the bottom. Can he make it to the line? The 62 on the outside? No. And I failed to do the no camera. But Dexter Black wins it here at Armory Digital. Man, that was close. Really close. 62 truck able to get second place. Got the outside line. Had a big run. Able to steal a spot away right at the end from the 82. Chris Kyle but Dexter Black your race winner he got it back he got it back after getting dumped at Texas World Speedway so that's win number one for the number two team and we'll take a look at the full race results so Dexter Black takes home the victory the 62 team getting second Chris Kyle third Eli Bright fourth David Davison fifth Jeff Bright sixth Trey Wright seventh 39-8, 7th, 9th, and Derek Edison finishing 10th. Here's the full race results. 34 trucks finish the race and 33 finishing on the lead lap. A pretty clean race with only one caution and only four trucks out. Take a look at this. That Dexter Block, he was... He could have got beat both ways, either inside or outside. Looks like he had a big lead here, but that start finish line means a lot. Davison almost got it. He was on the bottom. There are three wide. Jeff Bright in the 42 trying to make it four wide. And you can see that 30 V Light Bright. He pushes that 62 trying to get there. Not a close finish. But they almost got there. Almost. You can see the aggression right at the last lap. Dexter Black able to take home the victory. Got a big help from his teammate in the 62, or I guess you could say teammate. That's probably a KHI truck, but whatever. It's my series. I say whose teammates are not. So there's a 2. 62. That's a good points day. Points night. But obviously wants to win. The 3 tried the bottom. Sometimes the bottom is not really the best way to go. And I'm losing a couple spots from that. But the lap truck, I think, really screwed him over. But he did do a good recovery. Tr trying to get back up there. He ends up finishing 5th, so he still gets a top 5 finish. He left the most laps though. 
but he's not going to get maximum points. So there you have it. So here's our full results once again. I'll now take you to victory lane.